Last time, on the Ballad of Bingus, this absolute moron got his estranged elf son killed. No, my boy! Oh, been mad. No. My boy! He honestly learned nothing from this, and it will probably happen again. No, not probably, certainly, but for now, let's end this intro. I'm not paid enough. Oh, right. This time, our hero needs to drag his ugly, misshapen hide to Coral. All right, so Coral, huh? What? What? That's what I'm saying, dude. This is bullshit. What is it? Dude, why is everybody so hostile to me? I need to improve my character's, like, personality or something. I'm tired of people just being the worst. Greetings. I see you've been keeping yourself busy. This is good. I believe it's time for you to perform some duties for your guild. What about these duties? <laughs> We are a brotherhood, a family. What affects one of us affects us all. Fighting, drunkenness, dereliction of duty are not tolerated. I would like you to speak with Modrin Orion. He will assign you any duties that are currently pending. Good luck to you. Word. Go hurt Horrid something. Beast. This Ready little guy. Do what do you want? I suppose you've come looking for duties, huh? <laughs> he said duty again. <laughs> they keep saying duty. <laughs> duties for you. Fine. I'll speak no, not slowly for me, for so the you toilet. can keep up. I want you to contact Maglir. Who's Maglir? Who the fuck is Maglir? He's one of your fighters' guild brothers, but he's defaulted on a contract. We can't allow that. Makes us all look bad. That haircut is not... <laughs> You're already making yourself look bad, my brother. <laughs> he Defaulted. didn't finish out a contract. Yeah, he didn't Skindra. finish a contract. Suppose I. Sh yeah. Okay. Don't just stand there. Move. I'm... Well met. Kill him. Greetings. We're all talking about the Emperor's murder. We have no Emperor, and... So anyways, then our hero had to journey all the way to Skingrad. What? Damn, dude. I think it's funny that... <laughs> that I have the adoring fa like the adoring fan is smaller than even a another member of his race by like a whole a whole head. What? What is it, brother? They send you to find me? Yeah, dude, you're Maglier. I'm Maglier. What do you want? You defaulted on your contract. Defaulted? I suppose so. I'm not paid enough to do the job. I was supposed to find Brennus Astis' journal. Okay. What's the problem? That was my job. Yep. They said it was in Fallen Rock Cave. You ever been in there? Didn't think so. I'm not going back. Not for that kind of money. If you care that much, you go find it. The contract's yours. It's not worth it for what the guild is paying. I've got a family to think about. What? What is it, pawn scum? Dude, they are just so fucking rude to me. Is it... It's gotta be... It's gotta be, like... Do I just have, like, dog shit-ass personality? Am I just unlikable? It's 50. It's not that bad, honestly. They don't like you because you're a fucking lizard. Look, dear. I love wildlife. I should probably put on my life detection gloves. Whatever those things are, they don't look that dangerous. I think Maglier is probably just a bitch. 
Yeah, C is just rats, dude. Ow. What the fuck is this guy's major malfunction, man? Oh no, some fucking ghosts. That is a dread zombie. It's not great. Honestly, it could be worse. Man. I remember when I was really panicking, Anakin, about these wraiths. No. What the fuck did I just do to myself? Wait, what? The fuck is going on? Why am I just holding my sword like that? What did I do? I mean, it looks awesome. Just warming up, you pathetic worm. Damn. He had some bass in his voice all of a sudden. Silence. You can't do that to me. I mean, you can. You did, but not allowed, dude. Yo. All right. All right. All right. All right. We found the last weapon we're going to need. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even think I was the appropriate level for this. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What level am I, dude? I didn't think that this was going to happen for level 20. I guess I guess Adric weapons happen at 20. I thought it was 25 or some shit. And then like I guess that might be armor. Dude, fuck it, we're using the new shit. Hold on. Oh yeah, son. Yeah, it's evil as hell, dog. <laughs> Knock him off, Mazoka, hell yeah. I thought she was about to fucking dive off after him. Damn, hold on. Did this fucking zombie lose a fight to these uh these these mud crabs here? Is that what happened? Is this Brentus? Why did you step in front of me? Oh my goodness. Tough little buggers. Are you okay? Dude, I swear to god, these are the, just the dumbest motherfuckers sometimes. 
Hold it. Do you hold? <laughs> Shaskar, you got a little problem there, buddy. You're still around. I've told you why I defaulted on the contract. Not too much else to be said about it. Do what you must. Uh, I got it right here. You found it, huh? Good work, I guess. Well, take it back to Oren then. He can pay you on the contract. Tell him what you want about me. Thanks. I'm not trying to shirk my duty, but it used to be two or three men would be on this. I like the guild, but I've got a family to consider. Sounds like you're a pussy. I say as I go in there, a team four man strong. Evening. Well, Mazoga. <laughs> <laughs> Evening. Get a move on. Hi. Get a move on. Why are you talking to me? Shouldn't you be finding Maglier? Dude, I'd punch this guy in the fucking face, like right now. Like if I was Bingus, walking around with like almost 300 HP and like all these spells and shit, I would just fucking crush this guy's weird. Actually, that's a pretty normal looking nose in this game, to be honest. Never mind. I would crush his nose, though. I'd for sure do it. Maglier. So, I assume you've dealt with Maglier. Tell me about why he defaulted on his contract. Because he's a bitch. <clears throat> this doesn't sit well with me. Not well at all. Still, the job got done. Well, all right. What about more duties? <laughs> yeah, what about duties? Back for more work, are you? Good. Some of our boys are causing trouble in Leowin. Looks bad for the guild. Looks bad for the guild? What do you mean, causing trouble? Some of your brothers have been getting rowdy at the local tavern. I've got no problem with cutting loose, but I don't like it when we all look bad. You're looking for Relian, Vantus Prelius, and Dubak Groshok. You made those words up. So they're gonna be drunk and disorderly. I imagine Five Claws Lodge? I remember there was... yeah. Your fighters guild. Get them out of here. Causing trouble? Causing trouble, yes. Causing much trouble. Scaring customers. Breaking furniture. Bad, bad men. Alright, I'll sort it out. Don't worry. Make them leave now. Oh, that dude, that's that one bitch. Witsy Dootsy. Time with you. Dude, you're I'll Witsy Dootsy. Let an orc drink here again. Damn. Hurry it up, swamp rot! I'm thirsty over here. Jesus Christ, they're racist as fuck. You're paying Dude, for they're synchronized. You're not half the man your father was. What the Mind fuck? Mind your damn business, stranger. More damn. beer, sweet cakes. <laughs> what do you want? What do you want? No trouble here. No nothing here. No fun, no work, nothing. Blackwood Company's got all the work. There's nothing left for us, except for drinking. Blackwood Company? Tell me about that. Haven't you heard of them? Nope. Former soldiers sent down into the swamps to take some territory back from the lizards. Talk to Vantus. Shove off. All right, Vantus. It's not wise to interrupt us in the middle of our discussion. I will beat the brakes off of you in the middle of town. Nobody can stop me from killing you. There is nothing that you can do in this entire game. Literally, nobody can stop me. I've killed Mana Marco. I'm the champion of the fucking arena. I'm the Archmage. I, I'm the greatest thief in Tamriel. All those things, and you think you can do anything to me? Ridiculous. Also, Mazoga is just looming in the background, ready to fucking snap this guy's neck with a single punch. <laughs> I think this guy's being a little silly. We'll forget this happened. He's drunk. It's okay. Um, the Blackwood Company. I spit on them. Mercenaries sent by the Emperor to reclaim territory in Black Marsh. When they failed, they came back and set up shop. They've been undercutting us on contracts ever since, and they've no qualms about accepting jobs no guild member would be caught dead doing. Hmm. You need work to keep busy. 
A brilliant idea. Orion only sends his best these days. Tell you what, you go find us some paying work and we'll happily go about it. All right. Much obliged, my friend. You don't find something soon, I'm gonna lose my temper. Dude, I will. Hold on. Fucking moron. You've always been too smart for your own good. Yeah. Fucking moron. All right, that felt really good. Jobs for the Fighters Guild. Hmm. Try Margart. If she's not Margart, eh? Margart. Go fuck us, Margart. Hey, look, it's Maik the liar. Maik knows much. Tell some. Maik knows many things others do not. Maik wishes he had a stick made out of fishies to give to you. Sadly, he does not. I, uh, I'm thinking about changing vices. I think I'm going to give up um, uh, nicotine for getting fat. Why are you in the yes. middle of the woods? What can I do for you? You can, you can put on some, Good day. some fucking shoes. Damn, bitch. Do you really just be walking around the woods with them naked concrete grippers like this? Disturbing, yet intriguing. That's what you can do. What can I do for you? Um, fighters go I jobs. suppose I've got something I could use the guild's help with. I need ogre teeth and minotaur horn for my alchemy experiments. They're tough to get, but I prefer fresh, and I'll pay well. And I just don't trust those Blackwood Company folks to find them. Well, I'm not sure about you either. Tell you what, if you bring me back five portions of ectoplasm, I'll give my business to the guild. That's my offer. I'm almost certain that I have it. Well, tell your men I'll... Yep, all right, cool. Farewell. Oh, dude, I knew I was carrying all that shit around for, for some reason. I thought it was 20, though. And I'm also pretty sure that I do have, like, like 20 more in my inventory. Now I can start using them. I've been carrying them, like, all game. Like, every time I'm I found one, I picked it up, basically. Except for, like, the last few sections, just because I had so many. You're... I've told you what we need. Here's the fighter's Find job. Find ingredients yeah. from our guard, yep. huh? Works for me. I'll let the other men know. Appreciate your help, friend. And Orion should be happy. Farewell. Are you guys going to be happy now? Hey, it's you, the one who found jobs. What do you need? Yeah, nice going. It's about time someone did something. These guys are killing my business. Uh, causing trouble? Perhaps they will cause no more. Perhaps they will have the gold to pay for their drinks. They're not bad men. They just need to be allowed to to drink alcohol all the time and also kill things. <laughs> I'm looking for results from you. What have you found out? What have I found out? Causing trouble? The Blackwood Company has taken that much of a foothold in Leowin. Those sons of... Say it. Never mind. You've done your job. Here's your payment for it. Dude, you guys will show me some, like, fucking feet bones coming out of somebody... You'll show me like exposed rib cage and like ripped off genitalia and stuff, but you won't say bitches. All right. Okay. Advancement. You've done well. Because of your efforts, you have achieved the rank of swordsman of the Fighters Guild. That's not a rank. That's like a prof. That's like a. That's like a thing that you do. Like you you chop people up with like a sword instead of like an axe or like hit them with a hammer or something. You don't. 
You can shoot people with a bow or like use magic. You can be a mage, right? But like, or you could be like a pyromancer. Like, like imagine if you could, you could like, I don't know why I'm explaining it to this NPC, um, but like if you were to do like, uh, you know, there's like a mage, and then underneath that you have like pyromancer and like um, uh, cryomancer and like necromancer and like all these guys, right? And then like you have like a what is it a uh, uh, warrior, right? But you ha you have like a uh, axe man and swords man and hammers man, and that's yeah. So now that that remedial is finished blathering, let's hear from our sponsor, AutismSpeaks.org. This is a joke. I'm calling Will autistic. You see, I looked this up, and legally speaking, no bullshit. I have to say that we aren't affiliated with AutismSpeaks.org in any way. This absolute cretin has said and done ethically dubious things on multiple videos and live streams, and I'm not trying to get my ass sued over a meme. Perhaps you're ready for advancement. I just got advancement, huh? I'm sorry. You're not <laughs> ready for advancement. <laughs> you fucking dickhead. Hey, hey, my man. Greetings. Uh, contract? Good to see you're working hard. I've got some more thieves for you to deal with in Anvil. Okay. Uh, gang. An all-female gang of thieves has been recently plaguing Anvil with a very unique method of robbing. They pick on only the men. If you want to help us do something about it, go talk to Gogan and Malona. Let's just say Gogan is intimately involved and leave it at that. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> Did you hear that, Mazoga? <laughs> Some lady touched Gogan on the pee pee. <laughs> Me. He'll need all the help he can get to worm his way out of this one. To think he'd fall for the gang's scheme. Ugh. I could kill him. I'm sorry. I'm rambling. And you look confused. Let me explain. Go on. The women in the gang use their wiles to lure men out to some remote location and rob them blind. It's been going on for some time now. Has it? The city guard hasn't done very much about it, because frankly, the men who are robbed are so embarrassed, they don't want to report it. Take Fair for enough. example that good-for-nothing husband of mine, <laughs> He cared more about their charms than my own. Yeah, you definitely, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> Well, I don't know. You know, we could get him drunk. He probably, you know, put on the beer goggles, blur his vision a little bit. Um, yeah, what about this gang? When Gogan was, um, with the women, they took something quite valuable from him. No, his virginity. It's not what you're thinking. His pee pee. <laughs> he was carrying a precious family heirloom with him. When he oh, they took his to seed. Oh, no. I think you should leave. You should shut the fuck up. They still aren't letting me live this down. All right. See, my wife couldn't. Yet yep. I yep. Went, after we exchanged words, I followed them out to a farmhouse. Inside, they asked me to remove my clothes and items. Well, I did. And then suddenly, they brandished weapons and robbed me. They sent me away with barely a stitch of clothing. Harlots. Just please help me get that ring back. I want to save what's left of my marriage. <laughs> Do me a favor. Don't say anything to the other guards that I fell for it, okay? Thanks. All right, well, I guess time to go to the flowing bowl then. I definitely didn't go there before this and waste a ton of ton of my brain power listening to uh, some fucking Oblivion NPC speech. I did. I don't know if I can help you, but I'll try. I don't know if I can help you, but I'll try. Hello. Hi there. Good to see you. Well met. Greetings, Argonian. I don't know if I can help you, but well I'll try. Well met. What's Something going on with you? Hello there. member of the fighters Greetings. guild to train. <coughs> Goodbye.
I, I haven't seen you about. here before. The elder hey. will take care of things. And you're all Sooner alone, too. How sad. I'm actually not. I've got three well, other people with me. If you're up to it, I think we can solve that little problem. You see, me and Faustina here are lonely, too. And we've been looking for someone. You look like just what we need. I'll tell you what. Are you sure? We have a cozy farmhouse not far <laughs> from here where we could, well, get to know each other much, much better. I'll mark it down on your map just so you won't forget where to find Look us. Just scar Meet over us there, there around 11 o'clock. He looks mad, uncomfortable. About I can this. promise He's you like, a damn, night they of want this fun you dick. won't soon forget. A night of fun I won't soon forget? Yeah, a night of fun I won't soon forget, I'm sure. Night of fun, huh? Do I really have to spell it out for you? You're a man, and I'm a woman with a certain desire. You figure out the rest. Uh, no thanks, ma'am. I'm actually gay. Oh, dude, her name is Signy Homewrecker. Any word about the other provinces? I've heard nothing good. In Morrowind, they say the man is it supposed to be has gone. Can't wait to see you later. Don't keep us waiting. Hope you're not planning to get much sleep. <laughs> it seems hey. dire Those nice clothes. I, I can't wait to pick them up off of your dead body. Oh, fuck it. Damn. Damn, bitch, y'all live out there. What the fuck? Where am I? <laughs> there he is. Oh man, I was about to be like, where's my boy? There we go, Chief. Alright. Let's get a move on. Hey, what's up? <laughs> dude, I'm I'm a Bingus is a man on a mission, dude. There is there is possible uh fucking Poontang that is, doesn't belong to an orc out here. God, that feels fucking that feels fucking strange to say. You guys ever say something and immediately you're just like, ugh, ugh. I see you took us up on our offer. Good. I'm glad to see you. Sydney will be along shortly. I'm sure we can find something to do while we wait. Now, we can't have you standing there all uncomfortable in all those clothes. Why don't you take everything off and place it there on the table? I'm afraid not, ma'am. My virginity will remain intact. What? What are you talking about? Don't you want to have fun? Come on, don't be shy. Or are you here for something else? Oh, I'm here to fuck all right. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, I knew it. You're working yep. for the city guard, aren't you? Yeah. I should have. Okay. Just imagine ah! being a, just. No, don't worry. I, I came here to have sex. I know you guys aren't here to do that, but that's what I'm here to do. <laughs> Dude, that would just be the worst. Just an actual powerful mage. Just like, oh, you think you can get one over on me? Hey, what's we up? We had a feeling you'd be surprised when you saw us in our real uniforms. I see you have a puzzled look on your face. Ask away. Nope. I, I think I understand. Bingus just looks confused sometimes. Will, you have to play it anyway for the three people actually still watching for the story of an RPG from 2006. We know you've played this already. And we are more than aware of the distinctive visage Bingus has developed due to his ancestors' centuries of inbreeding, and how they make him appear confused or distressed. Just click the next fucking dialogue box. Gogan and I, we, the women in the game picked Mary. You fit the bill. Yeah, what about Faustina? We'll clean. Yeah. If you, you, yeah. you fucking jackass. You remedial imbecile devoid of higher thought or any consciousness beyond that of a loaf of bread. You went and skipped the fucking dialogue anyways. And what? 
You think making this rudimentary meme in any way saves time or improves the quality of this video more than recapturing the footage would have? Fuck. You. Will. You're a bastard. Sorry to skip through that dialogue, but it's not its not very interesting, to be honest. <laughs> 27 gold, nice, nice. Um, that's not as in- the story with so, them isn't as interesting right as, uh, what we're gonna find down here in the basement. Because if you come down here, you're- you're gonna notice some things like... Ernest's best shirt, Heinrich's shoes, Pinaris's iron cuirass, he's married. Heinrich's shirt, Pinaris's shirt, Heinrich's pants. Damn, 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 damn. I got the lusty Argonian maid over here on the fucking uh, table. Actually, I'm going to pick that up and read that on my new YouTube channel. Why not? I'm still working out the kinks. It's going to be coming out soon. I'm going to do. I'm. I'm. I'm not even shitting you. This isn't a bit. Uh, Pinaris's prize Minotaur horn. He brought that. What for? Was he feeling horny? Oh god, I can't take it anymore, I can't take it. You should all unsubscribe. This man is perhaps the least funny, least original, pseudo-intellectual on this side of YouTube. Can you come get this microphone out of my way? Are we done here? Is this what you fucking people call professionalism? No wonder this guy's YouTube channel isn't going anywhere.